hi guys and welcome to my channel for today and today i'm going to discuss about the new anime dr stone but actually this anime is not already new because it's already have some episodes that already released previously so if you already watched it before i think you already know what i'm talking about here and if you already watch you like this anime don't forget to subscribe to my channel because because i'm still going to create more videos con uh, content about dr stone anime guys so hit the notification bell to notify for my future video content and don't forget to uh, like our video for today guys but before we're going to move on guys i just want to know from all of you how many of you already watch dr stone guys and if you're going to rate Dr. Stone from uh, 0 to 10, what rate are you going to give for this uh, nice anime, guys, Dr. Stone? So leave your comment, guys, and suggestion and idea about the Dr. Stone anime. And let's move on to our topic for today. Who really Senku in real life, guys? So I'm going to discuss to all of you today Zenku in real life. So I think if you already watched this uh, anime, I think you know already who is Zenku is. I am so hyped to discuss about this since before guys. That's why now I ended up to make my own theory about this who Zenku in real life. After watching the anime Dr. Stone I starting to captivated by the story of the anime. The anime and the story is totally freaking awesome guys. So I think I'm going to recommend it to all of you to watch it. This is a very informative and very uh, uh, entertainment and you can learn many knowledge about our history also and the evolution of our technology guys until we already achieve this uh, new civilization so uh, I, I fully suggest this one try to watch it guys and you, you uh, and later on you will be hooked up also with this and with this anime so guys let's move on to my theory who was Senku in real life in my opinion in theory guys the real Senku in real life is not a single individual but for me Senku is representing our society or he represent the humankind yes maybe some of you guys will agree and disagree about my theory about Senku here because I know all of us have a different opinion and I respect it guys but before we move on I want to know all your opinion about this about my theory now use our comment box down below and if you disagree about me leave comment why you disagree and I want to hear it from all of you guys so don't forget guys we have a comment box down below as an additional support for my theory about this that Cinco in real life is none other than our humankind is that comparing Senku and humankind now is almost the same guys Senku is not individual but he is uh, represent humankind here in the real life Senku love gadgets and technologies almost same with the humankind all of us really love technology especially science guys and as you can see on the uh, previous episode of dr stone in this uh, anime he always stated that he really loves science and you can watch back it in the ep uh, previous episode of the anime we all humankind love gadgets technologies and especially science every uh, single things here in uh, around of us guys 
it revolved around science guys so that's why i'm telling that senko and humankind is almost same and here represent and illustrate humankind look guys everyone using gadgets new devices that having advanced technology and in short we all love science all of this is combination of science guys gadgets technologies even foods i think in our daily life guys we always applying science in our daily life same goes with senku that's why he's just he just like representing humankind from uh, the anime itself and compared to uh, to the reality in reality senku is the uh, is humankind guys just like what i mentioned before guys we all humankind honestly speaking love science and i will tell you this if you didn't love science you will not use any of devices and new gadgets now that's why i am uh, talking here in my theory that the real senku in real life is none other than humankind itself so if you like my theory guys about this one don't forget to like our video for today share and if you are not yet subscribed don't forget to subscribe hit that notification bell to notify for my future video content about dr stone guys and another supporting theory about this is the great desire of senku in the anime his desire to move forward no matter how hard the situation is even though the current situation of senku now is totally nothing just like he's starting from scratch but for his desire to rebuild the modern technology world coming from scratch is can totally compare to our humankind itself so if you disagree about this one you can leave your comment down below so let me hear what your opinion about this if i'm talking wrong about my theory about senku in the doc dr stone anime and let's move on guys senku has unstoppable desire to make things and move forward same goes with the uh, humankind guys comparing Sen senku and the humankind itself here in our current uh, world humankind itself has a unstoppable desire to moving forward and make new things as you compare senku and humankind they have a comparable traits of senku and humankind now as you can see senku in the uh, anime dr stone and comparing to our humankind itself in this uh, reality guys you can compare both of them almost same that's why my theory for uh, senku in real life is none other than our humankind itself in this video who the real senku is in real life is none other than uh, the humankind itself senku represent and illustrate totally same as the humankind i hope everyone you like my theory about senku in real life and if you like my video for today guys don't forget to subscribe hit that notification bell to notify for my future video content and of course don't forget to like our video for today and share it guys so that other people can uh, hear what my theory about senku who is senku in real life guys so until next time guys thank you very much peace out